بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اینڈ ویلکم ٹو آر نیو ویڈیو لیسن سیریز آن ایم ایس ایکزل دس از دا فسٹ ویڈیو اینڈ ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول پرووائڈ یو اے بریف انٹروڈکشن ٹو مائکروسافٹ ایکسل دا پرپز آف ڈیزائننگ دس کورس از ٹو فیملرائز یو اینڈ ٹو ہیلپ یو ٹو بیکم اے کمپیٹنٹ اینڈ کانفیڈنٹ یوزر آف ایم ایس ایکزل ایم ایس ایکزل is the most powerful, flexible, and highly useful software program. This video is particular for those people who have very little or no prior experience about MS Excel. Even if you have some experience before, however, you will learn and know something useful after watching these videos. In the first part, you will learn about a general overview of spreadsheets. And in this video, you will also learn about the Excel user interface. These are the two topics we will cover in this video lesson. What is a spreadsheet? A spreadsheet is a software program that enables us to organize, analyze, edit, and store data in the form of two-dimensional table. The table consists of cells. These cells are arranged into rows and columns. In order to facilitate our discussion, here I have created a table. You can see the table on your screen. This table consists of cells. Here are rows and columns. Each column is identified by alphabet A, B, C, D and so on, while each row is identified by numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. Each cell is identified by column and row. Here is the row and column which gives this cell the name B4. Here it gives it D6 and here it is F9. Here is another important question. What does a cell contain? Each cell can contain a number, a text value, or a formula. Modern spreadsheet program contain formulas for performing many mathematical, financial, and statistical calculations. User can change the value of any cell in the table. Here we have runs scored by these players against different teams. Now you want to calculate the average runs scored against England by each player. Just simply type equal sign, then type average or select, and then you have to select the range. Give the cell address or just select by mouse, and then press enter. You will get the average run scored. Similarly, if you want to add you can add the formula or select from here. We will discuss these formulas in detail in the videos. The second topic of our today's video lesson is the Excel user interface. There are five major components of Excel user interface. These components are spreadsheets, ribbons, sheet tabs, status bar, backstage view. We will discuss these five major components one by one. So let's start it. 
first we will discuss the spreadsheet as discussed earlier there are columns and rows in the spreadsheet spreadsheet composed of cells these cells are arranged in columns and rows this is the spreadsheet spreadsheet is primary area where work is done within a software program and that is the reason it take most of the space next is the ribbon here you can see many ribbons provided on the top here is the home ribbon with the help of this you can perform different functions for example you can change the font you can increase or decrease the size you can make the text bold italic or you can also underline the text you can do many things here the next is insert and similarly is the page layout so with the help of these ribbons you can perform different functions in the cells here is sheet tape in this document we have three sheets you can add the sheet by this button you can switch from one sheet to another by simply clicking here The next is the status bar. The status bar provides you some information. Here you can change the view or you can zoom the page. This status bar can provide us some additional information. Here you can see average, count and sum of the cells you are working with. Click on this file option. Here is the backstage view. You can create the new one, you can open and you can save. You can perform many functions provided here. Thanks for watching this video. Take care and goodbye.